Happy Monday, Bert. Yeah, all right. It's been about four days, what, since we pairings launched on Wednesday? Yep. Yeah, wow. four and days. Congratulations to the team. Really, really awesome to see pairings come alive. And uh, I think, you know, even getting retweeted and featured by Hayden over at Uniswap uh, was really verification and validation that there's something special going on here for pairings. But today, this is the Liquidity Providers Insight Show. And I think, Zaki, we want to talk about some of the cool feature improvements that we've done, uh, that you and the, the app team have done in the last, like, just barely two days. And maybe we could walk through and see what they look like uh, and what really liquidity providers need to think about when using this new tool, Pairings, from Similia. You want to take us in? Yeah, absolutely. Um, so I've, right. got the, I've got the latest version of the app up deployed on app.cilia.finance. Yep. Um, yep. And so, you know, as we as we launched the app, um, we immediately noticed, and I think you would have noticed last week, it was pretty, it was a little bit confusing because yeah. um, you would see the same token pairs um, uh, uh, appear multiple times in the interface. And you're like, what does this yeah. mean? Why is this here? Yep. Um, yep. So what they were is they were actually tokens trading at multiple fee tiers. Um, wow. And so what we've done is uh, we have created a nice little display in the search menu about what fee tier you are. Also, as you yep. search, you know, you can search, uh, you know, eat uh, uh, like, I don't know. Curve. Uh, so it's so helpful to know which of the that that there are three different t fee tiers we had users in the Similia Telegram asking, why are there multiples? So now there are the features. Yeah, so like for instance, you know, yep. UniWeth exists at both 3% uh, uh, um, uh, and 1%. And, uh, uh, and, uh, 1%. and 1%. Our, our ordering is by volume. Um, and by so, volume, okay. So you get, you, you kind of have this implicit information about yeah. uh, uh, what is the pair that is is going to uh, is 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 that is probably is where going. To your liquidity? Are, are you okay to take us to Uniswap and show us the different tiers and how they look um, in terms of volume, so we get some context, um, particularly for UniWeb? Yeah, why don't we do that? Yeah, just as a side shot, I was like, I was curious. So, go UniWeth. UniWeth. Here we go. So, so that's the uni. That's the point three percent. That's the point three percent pool. Okay. We should be able to get the uh, uni eat one percent pool as well. So. Oh, wow! Look at that. Okay. So the uni ETH 1% pool, let's look at the liquidity. So the TBL yeah. is 700K. Okay. And uni ETH is 81 million. One million. Got it, got it, got it. So I, as a liquidity provider, I'm gonna, we want, I want to be in the 0.3% pool. You wanna be in the 3.0% pool, that's where all the TBL is. Got um, it. And the 1%. And it's in, it. in the Uniswap interface, it's, it's right over here where the- right. And and what's your view on why folks are in you know putting TVL in the 03 percent versus the one percent? Um, I think that you know in general the the sense is is that the 03 percent pool is approximately the right fee range. Um, ah, okay. For you know the 03 percent pool is a the old Uniswap fee. Um, Got it. Is, is that's what it is? It's the Uniswap V two fee. Um, Got it. And so you, I think. Uh, uh, for stable coins, um, you know, the, this new 0.05% um, uh, uh, fee range was created. Um, mm -hmm. uh, but like in general, I think for, for most pairs, you're going to see the 0.3% uh, uh, be for, for the non-stable coin pairs, the non-like for like pairs. Um, the other thing, you, the other thing you're, you're seeing is, you know, uh, we are we are we are continuing to see like sort of odd distributions of liquidity. Um, yeah, that looks pretty a lot strange. Of pairs. Uh, you know, yeah. we see this like this sort of shape where again you would expect sort of you know in a world where gas was free, 
and everybody had, you know, uh, everyone's uh, automated bots and automated uh, 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 rebalancers were all mature. You would expect to see a much tighter distribution or a much more uh, spot price centric distribution, but um, you continue to see in Uniswap v3 sort of uh, liquidity lag volatility. Um, and that, that, is a, that is definitely a theme of this era. Uh, and it creates opportunities, and uh, but it, you know, for for sommelier, we're working on sellers, which is the next product after pairings, um, to uh, to provide more automated rebalancing capability. Um, Got it for those needs. Got it. It's pretty exciting. All right, so let's go back to the uh, pairings app. It looks much nicer. I see you have some new buttons, a, a, a new new uh, enhancements to the UI. You want to? So yeah. So the, uh, the other thing that was uh, uh, probably confusing in the last ver in the first version that we released, uh, you know, if you're not embarrassed about the first version you released, you released too late. Um, <laughs> but, right. uh, it was easy to. It was hard to figure out what bullish and bearish meant. Um, yeah. Uh, because it's like if I'm in, you know, West Uni, am I bullish Uni? Like, what do you mean? Um, and so you can you are bearish West, bullish uh, uh, West in this view. And you can click on this little arrow button and switch bearish uni, bullish uni, and our recommended uh, 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 bounds uh, changed. And you know, in general, uh, across the pairs uh, with the market action over the weekend, um, you know, the the sort of mean reversion based bias has continued to be good for liquidity providers. Um, uh, and continues. What, is, what does that mean when you say reversion mean bias? What what does liquidity what liquidity provider should think when you say um, that term? So what the Bollinger Band based mechanism that is sort of underlining our our market sentiment indicators, our Bollinger Bands are basically saying that like in general you want to provide liquidity um, around where the mean where like the average the average mean means average the average price of the asset has been over the last 20 days. Um, and so we do this weighted, uh, 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 exponentially weighted calculation and look at the averages and look at, uh, at how the average has changed over time and come up with a recommendation. Um, and when you see the market retrace um, uh, like it has over the last, uh, over the weekend, um, you know, that means, you know, be, you know, having your liquidity distributed over that uh, uh, sort of mean range meant that you are continuing to earn fees across your positions. Um, and, uh, and, uh, you know, I think it, it speaks to, I think the, this is being like a good first shot initial approach, um, at how, uh, for like sort of many liquidity providers are going to be able to work with the, um, yeah. with Uniswap V3. That's awesome. I also noticed that ETH is checked on, but the other tokens are checked off. Uni and WEF look checked off. Why is that? Um, so we switched to single sided ad being the default. Um, on uh, on on uh, uh, where you are for ETH pairs being able to add directly in with uh, with ETH and having it uh, buy the appropriate amount of tokens on the other side uh, as the default, but we still have in this user interface. If you if you have Uni and WETH, you're able to you're able to trade. Oh, awesome! So so if I don't if I only have ETH and I don't have WETH and Uni. Uh, pairings will essentially swap me into the correct pairs. Yeah, yeah. Take care of that. Take care of deploying the liquidity. Got it. Got it. Got it. That's awesome. Uh, very, very cool. It feels like it's just almost zapper like. That's very, very <laughs> nice. Um, <laughs> uh, all right. So this is this means that uh, uh, folks can s continue to play with Uniswap v3 as if they were just in Uniswap v2, uh, and without the hassle of having to figure out whether or not they have the tokens. We will. Get them into the position. They can take a, you know, an opinion on position, and now we know which token they will have an opinion on. So if you have a strong opinion about Uni, uh, you you can express that opinion here. If you have a strong opinion about WETH, you can express the opinion, and and some of it will set you into the pr appropriate concentrated range uh, uh, or range order for the um, for the for for that particular pool. Cool. Awesome. Awesome. Thank you so much, and we look forward to seeing you have some more stuff coming on the pipe on Wednesday, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, we have more. We have more right. stuff coming, and as expect a steady cadence of releases from us. Awesome! Congrats to you and the team, Zucky. Look forward to seeing you in the next one. All right, take care. Bye, everyone. Bye.